Very cool. Yeah, you, your, your career has definitely been nonlinear. It reminds me of the book On the Road by Jack Kerouac. <laughs> um, we'll talk about that later. And, and you call, when we were talking before, you called yourself an accidental retail executive, but a lot of retail experience too, Gap, Macy's. Yeah. How, how is retail different from other types of businesses? Yeah, it's, it's well, it, I, I describe it as being different because it was surprising to me it, it was around the, I'd, I'd spent a good amount of time in high tech, biotech, and fin services. And those are not immediate gratification businesses, right? But those are things with long, long business plans and long uh, roadmaps. And hopefully you hit the market correctly. And you find out at that point as to you whether you win or you lose. Retail is about immediate gratification, right? And it was about, you know, you're only as good as yesterday's sales. And, 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 I, and I grew very attracted to the psychological component of how do I help customers understand that the things that they want are the things that they need, right? And being able to change the way that they think. You know, a part of it was both the immediate gratification, but I, but I fell in love with, customer, with, with uh, the customer experience as well, especially in the digital space, which is where I spent all of my retail time in terms of how could you take this open white space world and create something that hadn't been created before, or if it was created, how do you continually make it better? Because it was the perfect test and learn 